Hey, how you doing? I am Joe. Welcome to the channel and welcome to the start of something new. Well, kind of something new. This is the follow up to The Magician, which I have posted hopefully not long ago. Because of... Anyway, this is um, this is Australian. I love Australian content. By the way, I love um, Underbelly, Home and Away, Neighbours, all that good stuff. Love it. Chopper Reed. Um, it's Australian. I think it's a, it, it's a, like a series that follows up The Magician. The Magician was a 2005, um, like a mockumentary thing about a hitman and his neighbour with a video camera follows him about. If you're saying good back and check it out, it'll be posted on the channel, like before, before I post this, so you can go back and check out. This came afterwards, same characters, the character of Ray was developed in S series. I think it's like the magician was um it's you know Australian things, right? It's it's um quite serious but also quite funny, right? You got know I mean it's like it's like um murder and death but it's almost a comedy. Like I think the Australians are very uh, kinda humor, right? They don't take nothing too too seriously. Nothing's sort of nothing's really out of bounds, right? Nothing sacred, just kind of say it as they see it, and if it's funny, it's funny, right? Um, but, so at the end of The Magician, there's a little thing, and it's like, um, if you're watching this, this is like, um, he's, he's, um, he told his neighbour, if he dies, post this documentary, right? And at the end, there's a little bit, this is um, Ray Shoesmith was shot two months later, shot dead outside his home, right? And I guess that was a way to finish off that movie, and then they thought, okay, this is too good an idea to let it die. Right? We can make someone who is. So they've retconned it years later in, uh, I think it's the same character of Ray. I don't think it's documentary style this time. It's just a straight up um, series. I've seen clips of it on Facebook. I don't know if, this is, like I said, I think it was comedy, action, um, if it's serious. By the way, if you're new to the channel, I do talk funny because I've got a tooth missing. My tooth snapped off months ago. And if you tried to see a doctor since the pandemic, a dentist, if you tried to see a dentist since the pandemic, it's a fucking nightmare. I was supposed to see a dentist in January. It is now April, still waiting. But yeah, so to all my new Australian viewers, I guess, because I guess I'm too. So anybody who has come across this page from Australia, g'day. Sad. Good day. Good day, mate. Um, I says, Mister in between. I don't know what the name is referring to. Is it because he's like in between two lives? Like I got the magician. He was the magician because he made people disappear. Right. That's a good name. Yeah. He wasn't doing fucking card tricks. He was like, you know, pack a card and I'll let you live. No. Um. I think he was a magician because he made people disappear. This is um, Mr. In Between. Is it like in between lives, in between lifestyles he's living now? I think maybe. But enough talking. This is, this is for 2017 or 16, I think. Mr. In Between. My amen. So, where's, uh, where's Freddy? How come you didn't put the bed on? I did. I told you. You talked to me? Yeah. And he said you didn't put the fucking bet on. Oh, dear me, mate. He's a fucking liar. Mate. Careful, mate. Did you put a bet on her there? What? I've known Mick for 20 years. Oh. Babe. I swear to God, I put You just bet called on. Mick a fucking liar, mate. I know what Mick's talking about. Show him Ben to slap. Show him to slap. I got mad here. Americans mix full of shit. I think somebody's full of shit. Somebody's full of shit. Freddie wants a word with him. Yeah, I fucked up. I'm sorry, oh. mate. I was gonna put the bet on my. And you just admitted it, mate. You just admitted it. Again. Yeah. I up, I man. guess that's got to be one of those scenes. It's like a uh, showing the I'm character sorry, who he is. Sorry, mate. 
Freddy's got to say, come on, isn't he? Okay, thanks, Freddy. Thanks, Freddy. You ain't got to be saying thanks in a minute, mate. Oh, dear. Oh, fucking dear. Hey, yeah, man. Shoot the prick. Shoot him. Okay, hold on. Next time Freddy tells you to do something, mate, just fucking do it. Huh? Just do it. No, I know. Sorry, mate. I just. What oh, an Oh, shit. Oh, he's near dead. But fuck me, miss in between. <laughs> he's near dead, but I bet he wishes he was. Jesus. Is that showing you like the double sides, right? So he's got no problem hurting people, but you want to hurt defenseless animals or insects even. But somebody deserves it, he's got to do it. Oh, well, some bad news. Bad yeah. news. I had a bad week this week. You have a bad week every week. Yeah. What? What a look. What a look. How long have we been doing business? I'm a little hurt here, Ray, to be honest. Don't turn this around on me, shithead. You should have the money. Oh, he's collecting. Okay, okay. So he's a okay. debt collector for Freddy. Is it? I imagine. I've got a guy who owes me 10. Alright, over in Ashfield. You want to go get that? 10 plus a G on top. For what? For the trouble I got Ashfield. For collecting on the debt. Yeah, mate. Collecting on the debt. Oh, yeah, was... You, Terry? Who the fuck are you? Fuck. You are in my. Well, hurry up. Effective. <laughs> Effective. I've got it now. But I can get it later. I'll get it at the end of the week. Me. No, no. I don't have it. Come on, mate. I'm not your mate, dickhead. Is that a guy for your yeah, neighbours? What's his name again? I'm yeah. Count to three. Oh, shit. I don't have it. One. Look, I'll get it end of this week. I'll Who's that guy? Two. Curly haired guy. Who is he? Oh, if you're Australian, let me know. I recognise him. How long have you been married, Terry? Uh, Oh ah, shit, Terry. Get your wallet. Oh, he's got to get his address. He's got to get his address. You live in Kirribilli. Yeah. My man, are you stupid? This guy's a bit dumber. Hartley Crescent. I like Kirribilli. It's a very, very nice place. You stay here with him, mate, alright? Well, where are you going? I'm going to Kirribilli. No, oh, look, um, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll give you your money, okay? No, um, mate. I don't want any no. money. What do you mean? Well, it's not my job to collect money. It's his job. What's your job? My job's to make you sorry you didn't pay when you had the chance. <laughs> what a fucking line. What a fucking line. It's my job to make you wish you paid. Well, you get it now, okay? You go with him, if he gives you any trouble, Shoot him. you give me a call, right? And you got a He's a bit of a maniac. He is. No, don't Eddie. worry about it. He's Sorry. No, you're right. Your, your dog's not going to eat my dog, is he? No, I just fed him, so. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty yeah. the next oh, um, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. What's his name? Home, no way. Neighbours. What's her name? Boof. G'day, Boof. Yeah. Is that a Frenchie? Yeah. Yeah, Eddie. Eddie the Frenchie. Yeah. Uh, I'm Ali, by the way. Ali. Right. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So what do you do for a living? I'm a hitman. What do you do? I used to be on TV. Eddie. Eddie, come Eddie on. Eddie the Frenchie. Ah. Gotcha. <laughs> right. I've never been to Australia. I don't imagine it's a pretty warm country, right? In Scotland, a lot of sunshine, you're in a t-shirt. Like, this is is any sunshine, you're in a t-shirt. And you've got these fuckers in Australia wearing hats. Beanie hats and jackets. Fuck's up, boot. All right, Quentin. Ray. Quentin. There we go. All right. Have a good time. Who's that? Are you beautiful? I'm good. Yeah? Yeah. So, how are you feeling? Shake, mate. Shake. How do you look? What's going on? Nothing. 
Anything happening in the chief department? No. Here? Oh, man. Since I got the money in here, I've been beating him off with a stick. Mm -hmm. I got no cash. Okay, but you owe me. And if you that pay, I should be blocked next week and block your fucking legs. What's going on? I need you to come back to my joint. I'm in the fucking shit. What are you doing? Tat fan wanted me porn eyes. Wanted me David days. Mm -hmm. She's pissed as hell, and I told her it was yours. Why would you tell Move her? Come on. Because she was going to fucking divorce me, man. I need you to come back and apologize to her. For what? For leaving the porn at my joint. Why the fuck would I leave a porn? Why would you? Like, I don't know. Are you saying like a little? Group I didn't know what else. Group to say. thing, circle. I just need you to come back and apologize. Move on. This is fucking big. Hi, it's big for you. It's not big for him. Fucking hell. You all right? Racy. Hello, Ray. How you going, love? Uh, so I guess said you found one of me DVDs. <laughs> oh. It's got to be gay, it? Why you want to look at these things, Ray? This is disgusting, Ray. Why you like this? I don't know. You like to piss on women? This is why your wife get divorced. Guys. Guys, mate. Guys, mate, you've dropped him right in it. Guys. Can I avoid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm... Yeah, guys. Guys, you. You want this or not? Thank you. Yeah. Are uh, you him, big time, guys? You fucking owe him big time, mate. In case anybody didn't see the DVD box, it was them. Um, fetish, we'll say. Specialty. Tat's brother is over from Russia. There you go, man. The PP guy? Yeah, yeah. The PP guy. Hey, you know I'm not just into that stuff. No, you just. Know, you know. Not only. Other stuff. Yeah, other yeah, stuff. Well, like shit in people's mouths. No. You know, like normal stuff. Back to the same place, looking for the same person. Here we go. Here we fucking go. Go on, Ray. Is it? Why is he acting like it's cold? Genuinely, see, I daily cut in Scotland. We hit tops off, and I didn't put a short on. Jesus, man, why don't you watch where you're going, eh? What was that? You heard what I said. What? You want to start some shit? And what's your language too, eh? I'll piss off, fuck with. <laughs> yeah. Right. Oh, boys. Boys. Boys, boys, boys. Well, that guy, he owes me four dollars. Four dollars? Yeah. Four dollars. Go get it. Go get. I'll get it off him later. Right? Yeah, I'm sure you will. Uh, well, that's not true. I could. You watch still come TV. out and talk to me every now and then? Oh uh, yeah, sometimes. Oh. Sometimes. 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 I'm just gonna go in the news agent around the corner. Okay. I'm just gonna get a newspaper. Okay. Oh, this is called karma. Yeah. Karma is about to knock. Bet here, Dobby Buck in a minute. Is it Dodd? You right, old man? Oh. <laughs> right in the pills. In your run, like a little fucking bitch. Ah, shit. Witnesses. Holy shit. Hi. <laughs> Didn't recognize you. Uh, yeah, right, I don't blame you. Is your name? Off. Para paramedic, yeah. Okay. Ambo. Yeah. So, uh. I love what you're saying, talk. You're an ambo. Ambient cipher. Call you directly or. Just everything's just shortened. Fine. The... Everything. Sure, yep. Okay. Yeah. You're a doctor. No, you're a doco. I'll give you my number. Sweet. Yeah. Well, I'm pretty excellent, Brian, so uh, mm. 
How are you a bullet holes or broken bones? How are you with them kind of things? Stobbins. You good are. PP guy. Right. So, um, Mr. In Between, season one, episode one. This is called PP guy. In, oh yeah, this is, that's a spoiler. I'm going to enjoy this. This is, um, yeah. All about violence, all about humor, all about Australians. Yeah. What's not to like, right? So, meet Ray. We didn't meet Ray. Was return to Ray. At very start, we see Ray throw a guy off a balcony because he owes Freddy money. And that's like sort of your introduction to the character. Next, we see him in the shower take an insect. Oh, a danger, right? So, it's like the duality of man. He's got no problems hurting somebody who he thinks deserves it. But you want to hurt an animal, right? He's, he owns a dog. He hurts, helps things. Right? And I think he's got a, a daughter, is it? So he's working as a debt collector. I'm not sure we'll still be the hit one thing. Debt collector, bouncer. All around decent guy, right? Um, this episode called Peep Your Man because one of his friends gets in trouble with his Russian wife. With a special speciality video, and he blames it on Ray because she ain't into that. So he blames it on Ray, and Ray just, yeah, mate, that's mine. The peepee -pee guy, right? In a, yeah, in as he had one of the best lines I've ever heard. The guy, the, the guy's obviously get money for the guy. And the guy says something to Ray. It will get on money and race says, I'm here for money. And the guy says, what are you here for then? I'm here to make you wish you paid when you should have. Brilliant. Fucking cold this shit. Brilliant line. Would fucking terrify you. Right? I've got your money, I'm it. It's not my job. I'm here for something else. Brilliant. Love it. Um, and then he, he, um, he's wanting to shoot his daughter. These two bombs banging her. And then... Uh, Kind of get a bit aggro. Ray doesn't know what to start shooting for his daughter, so he puts her in a car. Hey, Ray, scream, I'll be back. Daddy will be back in a minute. Tracks him down, gives him a kick, and then runs, right? Because that's what happens. Because 90% of people are little bitches, right? 90% of people are mouth. And yeah, and then at the end, I guess he meets a girl, right? And I guess she's got to be a long term thing because she's like a known actress. So she's near in one episode, right, or two episodes. This has got to be like a start or something, hopefully. Because, um, like, hitmen need love too. So I was, I was um, episode one in the books, I was called Mr. PP Guy. Subscribe, like the video, share the video, subscribe for more. I'll get through these because these are short episodes, right? Three seasons, I think. Oh, it's bad. I hope you stick with it. Um, yeah, love it. Go Australia.